Hello everyone. Welcome to the YouTube channel Math1089. Consider a three digit number. Any three digit number. Extract the digits of the number. Now let us form all possible two digit numbers from the digits of the three digit number and let us find their sum. I repeat form all possible two digit numbers from the digits of the three digit number and find their sum. For example, consider the number 345. 345. So the digits of this number are 3, 4 and 5. 3, 4 and 5. So the digits are 3, 4 and 5. The possible two digits number that can be formed are 34 and just reverse of this is 43. Then 45 and the reverse of it is 54. And finally 53 and the reverse of it is 35. So, the possible two digit numbers from the three digit number 345 are 34, 43, 45, 54, 53 and 35. If we take the sum of this, it is equal to 264 and definitely this value is not equal to the original number 345. On the other hand, if we consider another number 132, then the digits of this number are 1, 3 and 2. Possible two digit numbers that can be formed are 13 and reverse of it is 31, 32 reverse of it is 23. 21 and reverse of it is 12. If we add all these two digit number, we get 132. So here is the magic. 132. It's the original number taken. So in the first example, 345, the sum of all possible two digit number is not equal to 345 but in the second example of 132 the sum of all possible two digit numbers is equal to 132 hence a question how many three digit numbers are there such that the sum of all possible two digit numbers formed from the digits of the given number is equal to the three digit number. Hence the question is how many three digit numbers are there such that the sum of all possible two digit numbers formed from the digits of the given number is equal to the three digit number. Let consider any three digit number as ABC. Obviously, A, B, C are digits where A is not equal to 0 because it is a three digit number and the value of B and C obviously lies between 0 and 9. So, we can write 0 less than equal to B less than equal to 9 and same for C, 0 less than equal to C, less than equal to 9. Now, as per the question, this three digit number ABC, which in its expanded form is 100A plus 10B plus C, is equal to all possible two digit number like 10A plus B 
and the reverse of this number means 10b plus a then 10b plus c and the reverse of this number which is equal to 10c plus a 10c plus b and finally the number 10c plus a and the reverse of this number 10a plus c therefore 100a plus 10b plus 10c is equal to 10a plus b plus 10b plus a similarly 10b plus c plus 10c plus b and 10c plus a plus 10a plus c which is eventually equal to 100a this is the left hand side plus 10b plus c is equal to the right hand side we can see 10a plus a plus a and 10a all together 22a similarly 22b similarly 22c so we can write it like 22 into a plus b plus c after simple calculation we can find 78a is equal to 12b plus 21c and if we cancel throughout by 3 left hand side is equal to 26a right hand side is equal to 4b plus 7c so this step is extremely important that 26a equal to 4b plus 7c with the condition that a is not equal to 0 b and c are any whole numbers between 0 and 9 so 26a equal to 4b plus 7c with the restriction that a not equal to 0 and the values of b and c lies between 0 and 9 therefore what is the maximum value of this right hand side 4b plus 7c so let us find the maximum value of 4b plus 7c definitely the maximum value can be obtained on putting the value of b and c as 9 so if i put in place of b 9 and in place of c also 9 then the maximum value that this expression 4b plus 7c can take is equal to 99 also 4b plus 7c is equal to 26a and a is a natural number that means this 4b plus 7c is definitely a multiple of 26 and since the maximum value of 4b plus 7c is 99 the multiples of 26 less than or equal to 99 are 26 52 and 78 so these are the restricted area for us hence we can consider the following cases suppose b is equal to 0 in that case 7c is equal to either 26 or 52 or 78 because already pointed out that 4b plus 7c is always a multiple of 26 and the value of the left hand side 
the maximum value is 99 so 26a this value is always less than or equal to 99 hence the possible values are 26 52 and 78 if 7c equal to any one of this no possible value of c so c no value possible in the same way if we take b is equal to 1 then the value of 7c is either equal to 22 or 48 or 74 hence no such value of c possible so no value of c is possible if we take b is equal to 2 then the value of 7c is equal to either 18 or 44 or 70. In this case also no such value of c is possible though it looks like that if 7c equal to 70 then we can find a value of c but recall that the maximum value of c is 9 not 10. Now the next case is b is equal to 3. If we take b is equal to 3 then 7c is equal to either 14 or 40 or 66. Obviously 7c equal to 14 gives us c equal to 2. So b is equal to 3, c is equal to 2, then find the value of a from this relation which is equal to 26a is equal to 4 into 3 plus 7 into 2 which is equal to 26 and hence the value of a is equal to 1. So the number is ABC which is equal to 1, 3, 2. So this is the first number 132 with the property that sum of all possible two digit number is equal to the original number. Moving forward if we take b equal to 4 in the same way no value of c. Similarly if we take b equal to 5 then no value of c possible but when b is equal to 6 we can find the value of c as 4 we can find the value of c as 4 as a result the value of a is equal to 2 continuing with the similar argument as above therefore the number in this case is ABC which is equal to 264. 264 is the next three digit number with the said property. Moving forward if we take B equal to 7 then no value of C is possible. With the same argument no value of C and as a result no value of a similarly when b is equal to 8 no value of c is possible but finally if the value of b is equal to 9 then we can find the value of c as 6 and hence the value of a as 3 since the three digit number is a b c 
So the required number is 369 here. So 369 is the third and the last three digit number with the said property. So in a nutshell, we find that there are only three numbers with the said property. And what are the numbers? The first number is 132. The second number is 264. And the third number is 369. Can you see any similarity in these three numbers? Suddenly, yes. The second number is just the double of the first number. And the third number is just the thrice of the first number. Hope you like the video. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to our channel and share the video. Thank you. Thank you once again.